Hello again, everybody. I am Jesse Ladner. And on this video today, I just got this computer yesterday from my aunt. Um, I think it needs some work on to it. This is a HP Pavilion model um, S51414. Really, it looks like a really nice PC. It's got Windows 8 on it. Really nice. It's got Beats Audio on it as well. It's a Intel Core i3 processor. Here's the back of it. Now I just took that thing off because I really I thought the, my graphics card would fit in it, and apparently it does not. The power cord I did I left at my aunt's house because I told her I didn't need it. I had some here. The only problem with this thing is they have two DVI ports. No VGA, no HDMI. Here's the thing. Yesterday we, tr we did a little work on it. However, just for some reason, we had a DVI to HDMI converter, right? We hooked it up to our TV and it had no signal, which was weird. It didn't make any sense. So it has the... um. Two different DVI ports, as you see there. But I, I, the only thing is, I don't have any DVI cables. I got one ordered from Amazon. It should be coming in the next coming days. The next upcoming days, it should be coming in the mail. This monitor does support DVI and VGA as well. So, good thing this thing has it. It has the DVI port on it, so... We're going to, on the next upcoming video, we're going to have to take a look at it and see if, um, see if it even works. If not, then, I think it had a hard drive in it because the, when we powered it on, the hard drive was lit, light was lit, but I don't know if the system kept on freezing up afterwards or what, so it might have bad graphics or a bad processor or something I would power it up right now but I don't have the power cable with me but I don't know if it has a bad graphics bad hard drive we're gonna have to find out out that soon enough CD drives actually well I can't open that never mind CD drives actually inside there I took the cabinet off before I couldn't find the hard drive I don't know if it's mounted with the CD drive or what but I couldn't find a hard drive for some odd reason. Really a good computer. So that was just a quick overview of it. Really nice. But like I said, somehow that graphics card does not fit up in here like it should. Probably because it's a slim computer. That could be why it's, it's a slim Computer, probably why that is. So, yeah, that was just a quick overview. I'm still waiting for a, a DVI cable to be to come or to come in the mail. Excuse me. Oh my God, sorry. Um, sorry. Anyways, something bit me there. Anyways. Hoping. Hoping I'll get this thing fixed. But for now, there's nothing else I can do about it right now. But I don't get why the converter, DVI to HDMI converter, didn't even work. It was just kind of odd. But if it's if it, but if it's not the video, if it's not the converter, if it's not the cable, then who? That's gonna be more problems. Yeah, that's, that's, so that's why I was that's why I wasn't home yesterday. I went we went to my aunt's house and I'm trying to help her out with this. And I'll just show you this. there's the specs of it right there. <clears throat> Got the second generation Intel Core i3 2130 processor. It's got a four gig 
system memory. It actually, I actually did look where the memory is. It does have the dual memory slot or chip. It has the dual memory. So, but it only has one four gig up in there. One terabyte hard drive. Intel HD Graphics 2000. Um, super mini DVD burner. It has a has a wireless LAN card already in it. So that's good. Beats audio, Windows 8. But this computer would be better once I get it fixed. But I guess it's not mine. I'm probably going to give it back to my... I'm going to give it back to my aunt once I do fix it. <clears throat> oh, I'm losing my voice already. But until then... And you can see the top of it. And there's a capacitor right there. You can see that. I already see that. A capacitor is in there. But, yeah. Alright, well this project will be uh, continued. Will be at a continu will continue at a, at some time at a later point. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit like and subscribe. And we will see you on the next one.